Hey guys, what's up? Here we are with another unique weapon review, this time on the Torg rocket launcher, known as the 12 pounder. Now, in order to get this gun, you must have Captain Scarlet and her pirate's booty. Now, let me show you where to get it. You're gonna wanna go to any fast travel station, and you want to go to Hater's Fo Folly, or Foley, something like that. Doesn't matter. Just right there. See right there? Go there. Good. Okay. Now, the drop I'm going to be getting is level 48, but the gun I'm going to be showing you guys is the gun at the beginning of the video, level 51. They're both pokey dokes, which probably has to do with the blade on the front. But, now this way, you're going to want to run this way. Don't go to the right, because then you'll, like, get sidetracked by the two badasses there. But So this is the fastest way possible. Just go to the left, run this way. Now I phase lock him there just because my class mod makes me go faster, but you could just run past him, he won't do anything. We may shoot a few times, but that doesn't matter. And then, if you have, like, ki spoiler warning, killed Big Sleep and Sandman, well, you would have have to to get this gun, because you're getting it off of Big Sleep. But if you have killed them, you'll be able to just get on this elevator and not run all the way around. Now, this is a rare drop not going to get it every time. It's definitely easier than getting a legendary. But you get there he is. He appeared right there. Big sleep and take him out and he should drop the 12 pounder. Now, the 12 pounder, it it has a big base damage. Like no multiplier though as you saw at the beginning of the video. Look, there it is right there. That guy almost wrecked me, but that doesn't matter. See, here it is, this is the level 48 version. Big base damage, a pretty decent reload speed for a rocket, but a magazine size of 1. That's because it's basically a cannon that fires a cannonball. And it arches like a cannonball and everything, so you, when we get to the gameplay, I'll talk more about that. But, basically, now it is possible to get two rockets or cannonballs in this gun, but I haven't got one, I got the single. So, here it is. I'm going to fail a little bit at first, because I wasn't too sure how to use this. It does arc. See how it just goes past them and doesn't even notice? Don't know why. Got you got to hit them directly, and it arches, so it's a little tough. Like, I'm pretty sure... I, see, I miss a lot. But in a second, I'm going to start aiming at their feet, and that's probably how you want to do it. Because you hit the ground below them, they're going to die every time. Now, this will basically kill like most enemies in one shot but if you saw the red text it was uh... it's in latin and there's no like real translation for it but it could either mean not unequal to many or above all or greater than all and that motto was used by louis the fourteenth of france when he was casting cannonballs and uh... the term twelve pounder is a common term for a cannon that fires 12 pound projectiles. So. Now, this gun's special is basically it, it fires a cannonball, of course, and it, it arches. It is excellent against single targets. You're not going to be able to take out a group with these, and I don't try to. And, uh, it's kind of weird to fire, but, but you, get, you get the hang of it after a while. Basically, like, see right here, Crusher, gone. And I think I do it to a Goliath, too, so... You could pretty much one-hit, like, all big enemies with this thing. This is a pretty decent rocket. Definitely don't want to go for groups. I say fighting, like, a big boss with this would be pretty good. But, like, see, there it is, the Goliath, gone. That's what I have to be. And I think I hit this buzzard. Yep, buzzard, gone. Bye-bye. Crash, crash. Boom, boom, right next to me. I think it, it takes me a few tries at this guy, because it does have a weird firing arc to it. And I tried to use that arc to hit him right there, but I kind of failed. There we go. That's where I get him. Now I'm going to show you the damage of this gun and the way it fires. It's kind of hard to see, but I'm sure you saw it before. It fires in an arc. See right there? It kind of just went to the floor when I was pointing straight. Now there's the damage. Basically, over half a million damage just from this. Now, I try to hit criticals, 
I don't think you can, truthfully. I'm sure it's possible, but I don't think I've ever hit a critical with a rocket. And the corrosive thing, I still gotta take that off. Sorry, all these videos were recorded on the same day. But the gun does not do corrosive, of course. All tour guns do explosive. And that's pretty much it. I tried to hit a critical, guys, but I don't. it's not happening. Sorry. So, I'll see you guys later. Have fun getting the 12-pounder.